Hi guys, how are you doing? My name is Vamsi and in this video I'd like to talk about strings, the operations that the strings can do, the operations you can do with two strings, if you have two different strings, what you can do, you can either copy one string into another, you can concatenate, that is, uh, what, combining those two into one string, or you can, or you can, compare those two strings and see if both strings are equal or not so many you can do but I'll be telling you the few important ones that you need like when you're using files so let's create some character arrays to store like give us give character y and then give us same 30 now we'll print the user to enter some string enter a string and we'll scan it to x since it's a string put percent as and then just copy and again print it alright now just use y to scan it now if you just try to print both the x and y it will print y both the axes and the y's that are there using so let's just print don't be ready right now puts off y y now what this will do is it will just print the values I mean strings x and y that we entered right yeah. if we enter then it will print the two strings here let's just give it a clear view the output so you can understand it even good the output is alright now it just showed the two strings right so if you wanna use string copy first let's use a string con concatenation like combining two strings so what it will do is a uh, if you use string concatenation is it's string concatenation is a string cat for the shortcut all you have to do is <laughs> mention the names of the strings so now what will be do done is uh, y will be what fixed or y will be what written at the end of the x if suppose we entered x as vamsi and y as krishna then y will be taken and printed at last of x that is now the new x will become Vamsi Krishna ok uh, let's run it and see now use puts of x here and puts of y to see how the things will go alright now let's enter Vamsi the first string and this for the next string so it's telling output is in x it's storing Vamsi Krishna that is it concatenated both and then y is still Krishna okay that's how it combines both of the like the right one to the left one it, it'll put okay I hope you guys understood it and now like do string copy so string copy is strcpy and this is also you have to write it similarly and what this will do is it will copy y into x that is x will be overwritten so here what you have to do is uh, alright now let's try to print it directly and see what will happen it will print Krishna on both because x is overwritten by the y so I mean y is copied to the x and that's how string copy works and now let's do string compare string compare is uh, something like which will return some value by comparing the two strings that is uh, if you compare both of the strings x and y hmm, it, it uh, like if both the strings are equal then it will return a value of zero if the strings are not equal then it will return a what a value some value like uh, I'll be telling you guys it clearly after I've written the code here I'll tell if both the strings are not equal print yeah uh, no, not like this but 
you can print something like uh, puts off hmm. this for both the strings are not equal right both the strings are not equal else you can just print strings are equal strings entered are uh, mm, equal let's try and see how it will work Telling both the strings are not equal, and then later we are printing this. Since both the strings that we entered are not equal, it's telling us that it's they are not equal. Now V M A S I. Now it will tell both the strings entered are equal. So what will happen here exactly is a uh, string compare will compare both the strings, and if they are equal, it will return a value of zero. So if they are equal then it will go here and tell what if they are equal if they are not equal then it will return some value either positive or negative the positive val value will be written depending upon the what the first character of this string 1 and the first character of string 2 if the first character of string 1 is greater than first character of string 2 you know the ASCII codes right by using that we can tell the I mean, which one is big which one is small okay so it will dep depending upon that it will return either positive or negative both the strings are not equal so we will just print they are not equal using this and you have many other string operations but those are not needed right now and i think this is enough for now and that's it for today's tutorial and i hope guys enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe